Alright, welcome back, my fellow Tarnished. This is Space Doggy coming back at you with another episode of Let's Play Elden Ring. We are chilling in the Halleck Tree Canopy. And boy, oh boy, did we get rocked last episode. Oh my gosh. Um, so basically, we're trying to get into that structure down there, from what I understand. And we just gotta play this smart, be careful. I was really rushing last episode. I think it's how to get ready for work and whatnot. And it just had me, I don't know, moving at a pace that wasn't ideal for this area. <laughs> I fell to gravity, what, twice? And then I got ruined by some enemies, I think also twice. So embarrassing. Ugh. So we're gonna just real, we're gonna be quick. You know, but we're just gonna take care of these enemies, collect the runes. And then move it along. We're not going to try to skip them. That, I think, was my number one mistake. I was trying to hurry, and then I was getting ambushed. And, you know, I was trying to hurry, and then there were ants in a different location than I thought they were going to be. So, so yeah. So, we're going to take our time. Slow and steady wins the race. One. Oh, shoot. Oh no! Oh no! Why? Dude, this is tough for me. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> I did not expect my, uh, my dealio to run out. Shoot, man. Okay. Let's try one more time. We got this. We got this. Come on. Probably don't need to grab those other three guys, to be honest. Alright. So those three, I think, will attack us if we don't get them. But there were a couple more that we got last time that I'm going to skip. Nice. That's how it's done. Okay, now check this out. We got one ant going uphill. We got two ants going uphill. Okay. So let's go for them first. Alright, we got this. We got this. Come on. Roll through. We gotta stay moving because those guys will attack us with their bubbles. Ah, oh, shoot. Power it up. Come on. Nice. Alright, we don't want trouble with the big guy. We'll get this one. Excellent. Alright. Okay. Looks like we haven't drawn the attention of the marshmallow guys yet. The envoys. Dude. Nice. 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 Okay. So, we could try to just run for it just I want to see if that's effective last time I was trying to grab all the items which is part of the reason I was dying so I was really trying to leave no stone unturned but this time we're just gonna go for it because we already have all the items so this guy right in front of us like way ahead is gonna launch some pretty deadly stuff at us here it comes here it comes here it comes Just gotta roll through. We gotta roll through. Gotta roll, roll, roll. Alright, looks like we're safe for now. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! Get that. Get that critical. Come on. No more. Yes, dude. All right, dude. Yes. Bro. We... Okay. I shouldn't say we. I, between recordings, struggled my butt off there. And I just want to see... I don't know if there's an item below. I don't think there is. Let's see anything. Dude, we did it. Nice. 
I died more times than I care to admit trying to do that. Dude, there is something here. There's like a ladder. Hold up. Wait a minute. What? I didn't realize there was a ladder here. What the heck, man? Which way to go then? Oh, that's a hard decision to make. Alright, let's take the ladder down and just see... That would have been simpler, just sprinting down to the bottom. Alright, let's see, let's see. There's a lever. So the contraption is way down there. Okay, okay. Oh, heck yeah, dude. That's what we need. Side of grace. Thank you very much. All right, all right, we're moving, man. Yeah, we're we're moving and shaking now, baby. All right. So since we got that grace, I do want to go up and exhaust the other pathway. Oh, I'm so glad we found that. Cause now, at least if we die, we don't have to like start over on the rickety cricket branches, you know, up top. Okay. Yeah, that scarlet rot hangs on. Doesn't it? Just gonna accept that we got scarlet rot I do have some items but I only have a couple ah crap what am I missing okay yeah cuz kind of what happened it like distracts you from dodging that guy's attacks from down the way you know, you got Scarlet. Dang it. Alright, let's heal up. And we'll use this bolus. I think we're approaching that place where we jump off. Yeah. Oh gosh. Alright, I was a little nervous I was off. Alright, we're good. Back on track. Here we go. Do we want to deal with that flower? Probably not. Do we? I feel like he's not going to give us anything. It's just going to be a bunch of time spent, you know. Dude, these flowers are, they're resistant. Resistant to change. You know what we need to do real quick is make some preserving boluses. And I'm talking like 18 of them, 19 of them. Yeah. Uh, maybe like 15. Yeah. Just in case, we might need to make some other stuff, but we definitely don't want to just have two of those things in our, you know, quick menu. So, okay, so we're back here. It looks like we can go two directions. Down ahead, but be wary of checkpoint. That is a great tip. Okay. Let's see what's up here. Dude, this Halleck tree has been the hardest part for me. Hands, like, without even, even a close second place. Man. I haven't died this much since we started this game. Okay, here we go. I don't think there's anything in this tree other than the risk of death. So we could drop onto that roof, but let's go see what's up here. Because I see some enemies, and they look like trouble. And we're gonna go correct that. We're gonna go fix this up. Man. The Halleck Tree. So, Mikola, the story goes that Mikola created the Halleck Tree. Oh, shoot. over here. I don't, dang it, dude. What's the way? Moonvale, maybe? Throw our wave a little better? 
So our wave was getting stuck on that incline, you know. Alright. Let's get up here. Yeah, we should be able to handle this. Even if we just run up and grab it, like, that might be all we need to do. Because honestly, I'm getting sick of this tree warfare. I feel like... I feel like I suck at this game, honestly. It hurts my feelings. What am I doing? Oh, right, right. Yeah, we're gonna get the rot, and it's cool. Go, go, go. Holy crap. Alright, heal up. Roll, 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 roll. Roll. Heal up. Roll, 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 roll. Alright, preserving boluses. Dude. What a freaking jerk. Charge it! Charge it! Yes. He did that. Come on. Alright. So we got our runes up here. We got five flasks. Sneak attack? Got the item. Run, 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 run. <laughs> uh, suckers. Maybe we can take this at our own pace. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. Dude, he's got range, man. Wow, he's got range. Oh, shoot. I thought I was about to roll off, man. Get out. Yeah. Dude, that was kind of hard. Envoy's Longhorn. Okay. <laughs> wow, all right. That was a good fight. Three flask left. All right, all right. We really, we really worked hard on that. <laughs> that was good. That was good. I feel, feel like we really earned that. You know, had to adapt the strategy a, a bit, smidge, try down. So it, why not? Okay. Ooh, we got a red main. One of those lion guys. Quit lying, guy. You know. That was stupid. All right. Where? Where do we go now? Where do we go? Ooh, seems like they would hide an item up here. But I don't think that they do. No, 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 I don't. Alright. That's cool. Alright. Checkpoints. Bada boom. Coffee break. So we are now at the Halleck Tree Town. I can't believe last episode I lost like 200,000 runes. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I mentioned this, I think it was last episode, but we are at level 131 now. And I'm willing to take us to 150, but not a level higher. So, whatever we end up doing with our build, because I think I'm going to move away from this intelligence build at some point. I'm having fun with it. I just want to try something else. I was, I've been curious about arcane for a long time. Like, I just, I've never really understood that stat. It just seems so random. Oh gosh. So this is called a misbegotten. Did not know that until like yesterday. I've been calling these guys demi humans. They are not demi humans. They are the misbegotten. Man, misbegotten. 
pay attention. More like... I don't know. <laughs> Durable sons of guns right there. I hate those slow moving dudes that just ruin your life. Okay. Let's climb up here. I think climbing up here will take us to that red main lion dude. Which. Oh. What's wrong with you, man? Rock grease. Nice, nice. Okay. Mm. Forgot how tricky this map is. Okay, so let's deal with him because it seems like this whole path is just for an item. Definitely want that. Come on, fella. Let's go. Like that, you filthy the animal. Throw him back. This is not like the visceral attacks in Bloodborne, is it? In Bloodborne, man, you do a visceral attack, basically the critical attack of that game, they get launched sometimes. It is pretty awesome. Pearl Drake. Hold up, hold up. That Pearl Drake talisman, I think, is something we'll want to use. Maybe more in the boss fight, like the boss arena. Let me see, let me see. Where is it? Why am I blind? I, I went right by it. Yeah, non-physical damage negation. Plus two. That's, that's significant. I want to see slowly restores HP. We're going to pop that on. In lieu of the critical strike granting us health, I wonder if this will be more effective. It's super slow growth, but it's still something. Bro, they put that plus two talisman in such an just not really that inconvenient, but definitely out of the natural path that you would take. Oh shoot. Okay. Alright, these guys are Roddy. Roddy. Roddy and Roddy. That's what I always say. Dude, that's a lot of swings to take them out. All right, so I think we gotta keep moving this way, unless we jump down somewhere. So the rock guys, whoa! Did you see that? Man, try to push me. Don't push me, cause I'm close to the edge. Dude. Not nice. Come on. Get out of here. And these guys are stinking tough. Okay. Toxic mushrooms, melted mushrooms. Lottie friggin' duh. Oh wow. Get out. Bam. Come on. All day. Dude, it's gonna be hard switching to a different sword. Because I do think having that ranged option makes life way easier in this game. You know, even though it's not a long range, just having the ability to get out of their striking range for a moment and still attack. That's just a huge plus in this game, I think. That's all. Come on. Too early? Oh, wow. Okay. Here's what I mean. Zip it a. Come on, son. Dude. <laughs> Alright. And I do have fun with this moonlight great or dark what is it called? The Dark Moon Greatsword. You know it throws me off because its skill, its Ash of War, is called Moonlight Greatsword. 
which I believe is what it's called in Bloodborne. Anyway, Dark Moon Greatsword. I really am loving it. I love that I'm actually giving it proper playtime, you know. Alright, let's get down. Let's get down. going on here? I don't quite understand exactly what's going on here. Yeah, Scarlet Rot, Scarlet Schmott. Alright. That's why we have these boluses. Come on. That's why I didn't want to do the bolus too early. We're going to get through this fight. Come on. Heal up. Yep. Do your worst, Scarlet boys. Alright, now that we're... Not gonna get inflicted at least for a second. Okay. See, I don't know why. I really don't like those. See, poison bloom, Miranda powder. So, you know, it's not for nothing, but I don't really like fighting those guys at all. It's just, you know, you're, you're just kind of spamming your best attack against them. That's really all you're doing over and over again, in my opinion. <laughs> Oh shoot, let's be careful here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. We got a lion, a red mane dude over here. We want to get him if possible. And, uh, oh, oh. Nope, nope, nope. Oh shoot. Oh my gosh. Do you see my health bar over here? Oh my gosh. Dude, every time I heal, I get hit. Every time, man. Oh my gosh. Alright, 1v1, thank you. Come on. Come on. See, I just need 1v1, and I'm good. Holy crap, guys. Dude. That almost got out of hand. All right, we are putting on our wondrous physique. Ancient dragon smithing stone. Dude, they're everywhere. I mean, they're obviously not everywhere, but dude, yes. All right, all right. <laughs> clip that, clip that, clip that. All right. Nice, totally worth it. Fire grease, that would have been handy for the, uh, the flower, the flower powers. Alright, so we came down this ladder, dealt with the flowers, went up this ladder, came over here. Looks like there is a path that way with a side of grace that I am trying to get to before moving on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you see these banners waving? I really thought those were like bad guys. Wow. Come on. Come on. Dude. Freaking A, man. I'm having trouble here. It's just not coming as easy, you know. Somber smithing eight. Bro, we're getting see, all this stuff we're picking up is just making me so excited to try a different weapon out. Like all these upgrade materials. Like, let's try something out, man. Let's let's do something weird, something different, you know? Alright. So we'll touch this grace. 
we need to go up over there, but I see there's an item over here too. Oh man, this area is crazy. All right, you know, I kind of hate to do this, but I think we should respawn. Or I mean, rest. Get our yeah. We need to. I got one healing item left. You know. Halig Tree Town Plaza. All right, we can level up one. Where should it go? Hmm. A little dexterity. A little faith. You know. Let's keep our intelligence. We're doing an intelligence build. I don't know why I'm fighting it. I think we played so long with the quality builds, you know, for this playthrough that it's hard for me to just accept that we've moved to a specialty kind of, you know, place. Alright, I don't like Meteorite. It's just too slow. Let me see. Some of these require, like, Arcane and Faith. Int 55 for Meteorite of Astel. Well, I kind of just want to get to 55 to try that, to be honest. To be honest with you. Alright. It's another Carrion... Bay links. Hmm. Try that. We got the shard, the great sword, shattering crystal. I felt like that was kind of lame. Oh, Loretta's great bow. Yeah, let's try that out. All right, moon blade, carrying great sword. Okay, let's try this out real quick. I just want to see all the spells I got. So the shard for range. Simple, basic range. Carrying Grey Sword, close range. Cavil, close range. I duel his moon blade. Epic. Just it's freaking cool. Carrion Phalanx. Wow. That's like double or triple the amount from the Great Blade one we did. Okay, R Loretta's Great Bow. I think that is my new favorite spell. Holy crap. Let's do that. Repeatedly. Okay. Oh, I remember this. There's something about these that you gotta, like, defeat them. Because the other ones are, like... I think they're like witches or something. Wow. Yeah, almost died. I'm cutting it off the closest episode. Gosh. Leave me alone, lady. Come on. I hate this lady. Alright, heal up. I hate you. So I think she will keep respawning if I don't find that other snail. There might be multiple snails too. So here's one. See? I don't know if you heard that second one, but there was definitely another blue lady. Dang. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Go. Okay, dokes. Somber Smithing Stone 9, dude. I love this. So, I mean, clearly, we might. I mean, it might be smart for us to level up our weapon. Oh, look at that shortcut. So, wow. So if we die, 
in this little area here we could just come down right here come on I'm so scared to roll here I'm so afraid Charge it. Come on. Dang, bro. Alright. My hands are sweaty, man. I'm like stressing this. Alright, alright. We're doing really well. Honestly, I don't want to jinx it, but we're we're making progress. We're grabbing these items. We're doing it. We're doing it. Being careful. Okay, so remember we still gotta go up that way. But, let's finish this alternate path. I'm so glad we noticed that shortcut. That'll help us skip a lot of enemies. If we need to. I'll hear what I hear. Hmm. Trying to spot it. Okay. It almost looks like I could jump there, but I don't think I can. Jump! This is why range is good. different for some reason. Come on. We've gotta respect our opponents here. I think we're doing this just how we're supposed to. Grabbing the runes. Smithy stone six. Melted mushroom. Actually, you know, I think we have the armor set. Melted mushroom armor set. Okay, so a ladder down this way. Ladder up this way. And then I think I saw another ladder down. Let's start this way. Hmm. Where is that upgrade? Oh, I see it. It's in there. And it's red. So we're good. It's not like it's a super... Seek dung. Maybe that's the door that's open if we go seek dung eater. Oh, I bet you that's the case. Totally. Totally. And hey, where do mushrooms grow? It makes sense. It makes sense if you think about it. All right, all right, let's go. Coffee break. All right. I mean, I'm very happy with our progress here. I think we're doing really well. Okay. The only thing have we gone in that room? I don't think... No, no, no. See that item? Oh, snap. Maybe we can jump from here. Jump! Yes! Nice! Oh, shoot. Okay. Charge. I'm so used to having the, uh moonlight on we're not using it golden rune 12 come on I wonder what the two hand is like ah crap two hands fine I guess 
Get him. That's pretty fun. I like that. Yeah. Dude. Seriously. Alright. I'm sorry I wanted to have fun. Freaking sorry. Dang. That guy kind of ran up on us a little bit. Treasure chest? Dude, our health. Okay. Viridian Amber Medallion plus two? Why does that not sound familiar to me? Oh, wow. Vastly raises stamina. From 130 to 150. That's actually huge. I wonder how many extra swings or rolls that equates to. Stamina might be, I mean, the more I play these Souls games, if I'm being completely honest, stamina, it sometimes feels like that's more important than your health bar. I know that it isn't technically, but dude, it's close. Because you run out of stamina, that's when you start taking hits. You know, like, if you've got it, for me, I get, I'm not that good at these games to where I, I don't really need a big HP bar, obviously, but when I'm running out of stamina, that's when I make my mistakes more than anything else, so just saying. Okay, so basically these ladders are more for the backtracking for us to grab that item, which it was a super valuable item to be clear, but I don't think it's leading us anywhere. Yep, knew that was gonna happen. Freaking dark, shadowy room. Yep. Scared me a little still. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. What's going on in here, eh? Charge it. Oh yeah, one of the tough ones. Not so tough. Are ya? Too little damage? Like, what's going on? It took like five swings. We have been picking up a lot of somber smithing stone nines, so maybe that's the game telling us, like, hey, do more, you know? Less is not more. More is more. Might be what they mean to say. What up, fool? Okay, okay. Be wary of danger. Yeah, you can fall right through that. Be wary of ranged battle. Oh, yes. Go, 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 go. Where he has a chance. Wow. Here we go again. Come on. Wow, that's my move. Come on. Come on. Come on, Sagram, please. This guy's definitely better than me. Okay, so up. What was that, dude? Come on. Please. Leave me alone. I didn't do anything. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna finish in the old fashioned way. The katana. Stone club. Oh, that's new. Stone club. Okay, we got what seems to be a boss arena, if I'm being completely honest, that way. Just make sure what path did we come down? Smithing Stone 7. I feel like we came from up here, so we need to check that. We need to check that. Alright. Maybe we're reaching. Is this that elevator? Oh, yeah! Dude, 
Look how much blood I got on me, man. Wow. Killing it, dude. Quite literally, killing it. Okay. So. Nice. Drops us right by the Halleck Tree Town. Okay. So, we still want to... Let me see, we're at 40 minutes. What up, Lana Fox? Hey, y'all. All right, so we need to check out what's over there, but let's go look in this other little shack real quickly first. Bada bing, bada boom. We still got that ladder to go investigate. All right, what are we doing? Hero's rune, excellent. Dude, we're grabbing some really valuable runes. So if we ever just need to level up quickly, we've barely used them this whole playthrough. So, okie dokes. So, let's go see what's over here. We don't have a ton of runes to lose here, thankfully. But, get that dark moon back on. Just getting started. Oh yeah. Yep. Freaking knew it. Can we get on the horse? No, of course we can't. Oh! That's not reaching. Nope. Come on. Get out of here. Get out. I don't really know if I can actually stagger her, you know? Dang! Get it closer to me! Come on. He's got a really similar moveset as the tree sentry. Dang, dude. Alright. We can totally, totally get this. It's so similar to that tree sentinel. Dang. Alright. Oh, what's up, Land Fox? Day's just getting started. I, uh, what can I tell you about this game? I mean, it's the greatest game, maybe of all time for me. So, I'll say that. From Software killed it two years ago, and I cannot wait. For the DLC to drop in about a month and a half now, actually. Really soon. Okay, where are we at? So we are at the town plaza. Okay, so there's two things we need to remember because we are gonna need to wrap up this episode. Um, one, we need to return over there and go up that ladder and see where that takes us. And then the other thing, obviously, is to revisit that boss. I think we're gonna defeat her, no problem, but. We'll see. We'll see. This place has been pretty challenging. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Lana Fox, sorry in the chat. I do need a boogie. Um, Got to get out of here. So, thanks for watching, though. Thanks for showing up, Lana Fox. Uh, as always, I post my streams over on my YouTube channel. It's got the same handle as my Twitch. It's SpaceDoggy777. And over there, you can find all my Let's Plays for Elden Ring from part one to this one. So, go check it out. Leave a like, subscribe if you want to. But other than that, folks, y'all take it easy. It's been real. This is Space Doggy, signing off.